For the most part, GPS works great. It gives people the ability to get from point A to point B with a simple press of a button on their smartphone. That's until you hit a big city. Tall buildings and satellite signals don't like each other, and in an era where companies like Uber and Yelp depend on accurate navigation, Pete Tannarello of California startup PathSense has this to say. GPS sucks. Uh, first off, um, it sucks in accuracy, especially in major metros where these transportation apps and delivery apps and so forth are thriving. Uh, you know, the satellite signals bounce all over the place. GPS also literally sucks, quickly draining the battery life of a phone as its processors work overtime to triangulate real-time satellite data. Tanarello and his team have developed a technology that tackles both of these issues. Instead of using satellites, PathSense has written code that turns your phone into a navigation device similar to what's found on a submarine. We are using inertial navigation, so we're using things like the gyro and magnetometer and accelerometer and other sensors. Um, and these are things that are, are able to run even when the CPU in the phone is not on. And without the CPU running, the phone uses 90% less battery than GPS. Ironically, thanks to satellite data, an accurate map of planet Earth now exists. PathSense utilizes those maps and uses the phone sensors to take the satellites out of the equation. We can know a map of San Francisco or a map of Arizona um, or Abu Dhabi. Um, we can know a map of the inside of a Walmart. And um, that is how we combine the sensor data with things that we know about the world and then continually correct. There are more than 500,000 apps that utilize location services between Apple and Android, a potentially huge market for the startup. Tanarello is confident his company is heading in the right direction.